Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel where I bring you brand new Pokemon videos every Tuesday and Friday. Today I'm super excited to be opening the 2020 Collector's Chest. I'm a little late to the party opening this, but I've been wanting to open it for a while and I finally decided to grab one. Also, before any of you guys roast my nails, I did um, a black face mask today, so there, there's nothing I can do. <laughs> The face mask just sticks to absolutely everything. So anyways, face masks aside, let's get into this collector's chest and see what we've got in store. And here we go with the plastic off. This looks absolutely beautiful. Here it says, packed with Pokemon treasures, three foil cards, five booster packs, and much more. And I'm not sure what much more means, but we'll see when we get into this. The thing I like about this is like, it's a it's a little box, a, a nice little lunch box almost. I would totally use this as a lunch box if I was younger, if I needed a lunch box. And here we go. These are awesome. I think I'll put these in my binder to replace the normal versions of these cards because these are beautiful. And here we go, I got them out of the very tightly packed area for whatever reason. Those look awesome. And we also have a beautiful little coin. I love these coins, they're so cool, so unique. And this one features all three of them, which is awesome. Then of course we've got the packs, which Oh, here you guys go if you want that. There's two Sword and Shield, and there's three other ones, which looks like Cosmic Eclipse, Burning Shadows, and XY Evolution. So this is actually filled with some really good sets. I like this. Very excited to get these open. Before we open those, though, I want to go through the rest of the stuff that's in this chest. So it looks like we've got stickers featuring the two box legendaries, Zacian and Zamazenta. Beautiful. And then we have some small stickers featuring the Galar starters. We've also got some larger ones featuring the starters and some smaller ones featuring the box legendaries we then have a notepad featuring the starters and the box legendaries that's really cool i like that and then we have a mini binder so that's awesome this is this is a really good thing to get for a young pokemon lover Definitely. You get this cool little lunch box that they'd be able to take to school. You get a bunch of stickers and a notebook or a notepad and a little mini binder to keep their significant pulls. And you get those cool cards plus five packs. And this this chest is only like 25 bucks, 20 bucks. I think I got it online for 15, which is great. That's why I waited so long because I got it online. But that looks beautiful. I'm very happy with this already, and I haven't even opened any of the packs yet. All right, so here we go. We are gonna start. Let's start with Sword and Shield. Usually I go with the most packs last, but we're gonna go in this order. Burning Shadows last. I don't know why, but Burning Shadows last. Sword and Shield is up first. Let's go. I want to get more Sword and Shield stuff again because I still need to fill up the binder. Here you guys go. Code card. All right. We've got Psychic Energy, Haunter, Thwacky, Palpad, Sobble, Pinkurchin, Blipbug, Rhyhorn, Mincino, Reverse Hollow Galarian Ponita, and Ninetales Regular Rare. Look at the way that coin is shining. That is absolutely beautiful. 
But anyways, as I was saying before, I still have to fill up the binder and I, I don't know, I, I just really want to fill up the binder of Sword and Shield. It's such a cool set. Um, from some of the cards that I've been seeing that are most likely going to be in Darkness Ablaze, I think I want to complete Darkness Ablaze as well. That set is going to be absolutely incredible. We've got Psychic Energy, Lanoon, Energy Switch, Bisharp, Baltoy, Chinchow, Sizzlypeed, Galarian Zigzagoon, Muna, Reverse Hollow Sizzlypeed, oh, I moved the coin, <laughs> and played all regular rare. Dang it, so no luck in Sword and Shield today. I don't really get very lucky with Sword and Shield, but let's see if we can get lucky with Cosmic Eclipse. See if we can pull the... Diago, Palkia, and Arceus card. That would be incredible. That's probably my personal favorite card of the set. One, two, three, four. Let's go. We've got Darkness Energy, Draw Energy. I have the gold version of this, I think. I don't know if the gold energy or if the gold draw energy is in this set, but I know I have a gold draw energy. Cosmoium, Clay, Trap Inch, Flabebe, Tangela, Duskull, Timpole, Hakamo'o Reverse Hollow, and Braviary Regular Rare. So nothing yet, nothing at all. Alright, moving on to XY Evolutions. You guys know I love this set, so hopefully we can get something cool out of this because that would definitely make up for the lost cards here's the code card one two three from the back since it's x and y let's go coughing misty's determination revive ponita doduo star you seal Charmander. Oh, we've got Starmie Break. And Dugtrio Regular Rare. Let's go. It's been a while since I've seen a Break card. I completely forgot that this was in this set. Wow. You love to see it. I know the Break cards aren't very uh, sought after at all, but... I don't know, I think they're pretty cool. All right, you guys, this is the last one. Sun and Moon, Burning Shadows. Can we manage to get away with another significant pull? I hope so. Code card for you guys. One, two, three, four. Let's go. Fire Energy, Seedra, Charmeleon, Whirlipede, Noibat, Dupider, Tangela, Rhyhorn, Ryolu, Meowth Reverse Hollow, and Beware Regular Rare. Dang it! So we were only actually able to get one significant pull, and that was a Starmie Break. Although we weren't able to get some good pulls besides this, I still enjoyed opening today's stuff. We got some beautiful promos, another coin, plus stickers, a mini binder, which I'll probably use for my EXs and GXs. That's what I did with another one, but it's already filled up. And a cool little collector's box. So, all in all, I think today's video is a win. If you liked what you saw today, be sure to hit that subscribe button, turn on notifications, so you know every Tuesday and Friday when I upload. Alright you guys, that's going to be it for today. As always, stay safe and peace.